Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you a nice trick on the new Edo D30. When you get the bike, when you power it on, it comes with default settings such as having three assisted modes and one zero mode. Zero mode means that if I turn the pedals, the bike will just freewheel and it will not use the motor at all. It's not using power, it's just showing the speed here and that's it. If I go to level one, if I pedal, I will get the first level of assistance and that will be around 15 kilometers per hour. On second mode I get about 20 kilometers per hour and on third I get the maximum top speed which is 25.8 kilometers per hour. But uh, because the bike has a lot of gears and the D30 model has even more gears sometimes only having three assisted modes is not the best because this doesn't have a torque sensor it's a cadence speed sensor so you can tweak this if you go to the menu uh, you just need to press up and down buttons here both of them at the same time and you are now in the settings menu I'm going to do a full video about all the settings but today I'm just going to show you how to tweak the assisted modes so if you go and press this mode here you can now switch various settings so if you go to p05 you can now switch with the down key this first digit this is zero and one with the up key you can change here to from three to five or to nine so i'm just going to select here five and here i'm going to leave zero and now i'm going to show what happens First of all, I have five assisted gears now. So on the first gear, I get the minimum speed, which is again, 15 kilometers per hour. Second gear is now about 17.5. Third gear, about 20. Fourth gear, 23. And fifth gear, it's the maximum 25.8 while the zero one it's the same no assisted mode and you can pedal without using battery if we go back to the settings and we go back to the menu here if i change this first digit here to one that means i will disable the free will uh, running of the bike so I will not have the zero mode anymore I will only have the five assisted gear so I can select one to five and if I go back I can no longer select zero so it disables the non-assisted mode so the bike will have only assisted working modes other things don't change here so it doesn't change speed or anything else so I also like the zero mode because this bike has very low rolling resistance and uses little effort so I find myself pedaling without the aid of the motor a lot of times and now I can select back the zero mode uh, there is also the nine gears the nine gears doesn't work very well uh, this should give you nine levels of assistance but uh, that is not how it works so if i'm on first gear if i pedal there's nothing happening as this will be very close to zero mode so zero or one are almost the same so the bike will not assist the second gear will be now the minimum which is 15 kilometers per hour third gear is close to second gear fourth gear will be 70 kilometers per hour fifth gear will be 20 kilometers per hour sixth gear is very close to fifth gear so nothing changes seven gear 23 eighth gear it's 25.8 and ninth gear is the same as eighth gear so nothing changes so the best option is to use it in uh, five gear modes and also leave the first digit to zero to have an assisted mode. So now having five assisted gears, it's a lot more better for you because you are going to be able to match the 
gears, the mechanical gears with the speed gears a lot more better. So you are going to have a lot more uh, control over the speed that you want and the assistant level that you need. And it also helps you save some battery in some situations when you don't want the bike to fully accelerate to 25 km per hour and you just need 20 km per hour. It will also help you avoid the ghost pedal effect when you just push the pedals a bit and the bike will accelerate to the top speed of the selective gear. So all of that is sorted by this. So I highly recommend you to do that uh, settings. Be sure to follow my next uploads where I'm going to do a lot more about this bike and the whole settings of the controller. Until then see you and bye bye.